So in this video, I'm going to teach you how to actually make it full screen. So all you need to do is to open your Firefox. Yeah, minimize it. Let me turn. I can just type Kali repositories. repositories. So to take you to the first link, just click on it and go to next. So when you open it, just come down and come to this one, regular rep repositories. Come to this one, regular repositories, and copy it. And the next thing is just minimize this and open your terminal. And cd to cd to Etsy apt. And then LS, you have maybe nano sources dot list. Mm -hmm. So you actually have um, sources dot list here already. What I copied, you can just see it. <coughs> so <coughs> let's say I copied it here. Oh shit, sorry. Control Shift V. Or I can actually right click and then paste. So you can see it's the same thing. So I actually don't need it. Yeah, I don't need it. So all you need to do is to do, if you don't have it, you just have to put it there. So control O to save and press enter and control X. And the next thing is to do apt dash get update. So you can see it's actually reading from the Kali rolling repositories. Alright, so the next thing is to do apt get install install Linux headers. Linux headers dash um, dollar sign open bracket u name dash r. You don't have to worry about this command, just type it. So you can see, immediately you do this, you can see a lot of lock and a lock here. So all you need to do is to remove this lock in order to do it. You actually find three locks. So I can right click on this and copy it. All right. Okay, copy. So all you need to do is step remove and copy this and press enter. Now let's do the same app to get install u dash this. I press I just press on the arrow key upwards. Okay. Another lock. So we have to remove this lock too. Now let's try the command again. Another lock, I think. Yeah, so this another lock. But this one this one it was able to read. So all you need to do is to right click on this and do remove and then set done and this is and I'm sure it will run from here. Alright, so we are done. Everything is set. Next thing is to just go to devices here and come to insert guest at addition C D image. So when you insert it, it will actually Come to here. So minimize this one. And you don't need to run it. When you run it, it will not work. So just cancel it. And all you need to do is to do apt get install virtual box virtual box guest utils done and then just press yes and wait for it to finish so 
So it's done. Almost done. Yeah. Okay. So let's finish up the installation and the full screen board. So all I did was to clear the terminal. You can just start clearing to clear it. So the next thing is to CD to media, and then you go to um, CD ROM zero. So that's actually where our virtual box guest additions are. So you can type ls. So all this you can see are uh, Windows files dot exe. All you need to do is to run this. Run this. Uh, so in running that, we just type sh and then dot backslash and paste that and let it run. So you do this. So it's installing. You just have to wait for it. Wow, so it actually came automatically. Yeah, so if yours doesn't work, you can just reboot your system and let it come by itself. So you can reboot it. When you reboot it, it actually comes automatically. That's if you don't have it. Yeah, yeah, okay. Bingo. So that is it. Kali running full screen. So just type your username, root, and my password. So done. Bye. So that is it. Thank you for watching.